A big hey to all the fans here, this is baby Tom Ivan Isco also known to all the fellas who like fellas as Mr. Backstander. Today's show we will be focusing on muscles, caring, and the proper way to discipline a Slavic male. Alright, I can personally tell you that a brutally beaten, bloodied and bound Slav is a happy Slav. And I'd like to remind all of you Asian women out there that just because he's behaving now doesn't mean he won't be setting any brown man on fire. If you ask me, a Slav needs to be punched in the stomach five times before being fed. That will remind him of the hunger pangs he experienced in the old country and lead him to realize he's actually lucky of being beaten on North American soil. Also, make sure not to punch a Slavies in the stomach more than ten times consecutively or we'll probably puke and shit everywhere. You have to remember all Slavs are deathly ill from birth, cursed with the crons. Okay, next up. Slavs have no muscles. This happens because they're always wrapped in bandages due to having YGD, yellow girl disorder. They cannot develop muscle because the rate of atrophy is much faster than the rate anyone can develop muscle. This is proven in areas with Slavs that are free of Asian women, where we see ultra-developed Slavs, hereby known as Alpha Slavs. Caring is also a very important part of raising a Slavic pet. There are two ways to care that your simple Slavic beast will understand. One requires a computer and a microphone, but is usually reserved for brown-skinned faggots in America. The other way includes putting a welcome mat on their backs and standing on it for 11 hours a day. Make sure you don't do this while we were sleeping, or we won't understand why it was done, and we'll just end up rebelling and shitting on your living room floor. That's all for today. We'd like to thank you, Asia, 